Hello, uh, in this uh, 184 lab okay, of uh, AWS Restart, I would be demonstrating about this. This is a challenge lab on uh, S3 exercise. So here, uh, this is the uh, 184 lab, S3, okay. So I just launched uh, this uh, workbench. You can see this one. I just start the lab and I explore the objectives of this particular lab. Like I just started, you can see this one. Yeah, what we need is that the objectives of this lab and launch the lab environment. See, the objectives of this lab is, uh, yeah, you need to uh, basically uh, create an S3 bucket and upload uh, an object to S3 bucket. We need to submit a screenshot for each and everything. Try to access an object in a web browser and make objects uh, not publicly accessible. Access the object in a web browser and list the contents of S3 bucket in and using AWS CLI. So capture the screenshot for submission. So when you are finished, yeah, you can finish off this one. So this is our challenge. And yes, some of the things which are uh, uh, given, like uh, we get uh, in uh, what you call as uh, uh, how to explore. Let us wait till, yeah, the lab is ready. Uh, so once the lab is ready, I can click AWS so that it will open a new window. Uh, yeah, the window is getting opened maybe later i'll also duplicate this one and uh, one thing i'll open this uh, what is this ec2 and the other one i'll use s3 okay so this is 184 lab yeah here you see this ec2 there is one instance also which is running you can make a note so this is your cli host which is having a, a public ip of 35.155.153.156 we can make a note of the host IP. CLI host. Okay. Yeah. Now our object is that you can even see that there are no buckets as of now. There is nothing, no buckets as of now. So the first task is yes, you can launch the environment. We have even uh, to connect to the putty. So for that, just download the keys. Okay, just download the APK keys. download ppk so here i have my search environment also and just say run and control d go to connection and say 30 and also ssh yeah lab user 3 yeah so this is uh, we are configuring using for cli ec2 hyphen user yeah AWS LS. Yeah, it is AWS CLI is configured. We need to configure our AWS con using configure also uh, the things which are defined here in this particular one. Yeah. So here is uh, your uh, secret key and access key. Just define your access key. Okay. Press enter. And the uh, secret key is. Uh, copy right in default it is a name uh, Oregon let's see this is US West 2 US West 2 yeah leave it like this so now AWS uh, S3 LS should show you the buckets if there are there is nothing hence it's not showing okay so our lab is ready let us uh, do the activities task one by one so yes we have configured all these things yeah all right now our challenge is create an s3 bucket so what i do i create an s3 bucket yeah maybe i'll say okay so in the same region he also mentioned certain things okay maybe like yeah he didn't mention anything just create a bucket maybe if he asks anything like upload an object try to access make the object publicly accessible we will learn all those things access the object using browser and list the contents okay 
So initially I will disable the uh, all these things and then just say create a bucket. So this completes my task one. This completes my task one. Yeah, this is three bucket. You can see this bucket one. Okay, I can take a screenshot and paste it into this document. So task one. Yeah, this is done. Maybe the next task is I'm just okay. Upload an object to bucket. So what I do, I go into the bucket and I upload some file, anything, any file is okay. Add file. So I'll just upload a file called as index.xj. Any file. You can add multiple files also and say upload. Yeah, the uploading is in progress. Just say close. There you have an index.html file. So capture a screenshot for submission. This is a challenge, so you need to do that. I'll say these are the tasks which are needed. Okay. The second task is maybe what I can say screenshot okay the bucket is created now that next task try to access the bucket using the web browser okay so when you click this index.html you get a public URL you see this one this ARN which is there just copy this one okay no no sorry this is the object URL HTTP try to access you are not able to access it is saying that access denied okay you are not uh, getting this try to access capture screenshot for submission just do that print screen yeah not able to access next one so what we need to do we need to make bucket ob uh, publicly accessible so what I do, I just close this one. Go to your bucket, select the file. Okay, two things I'll be doing. First thing is that I should enable the ACLs first of all. So make it go to properties, go to properties and you see maybe uh, not website hosting uh, go to permissions this one this one edit and say block unblock save changes this is the first thing which you are doing and say confirm yep this is done and also enable our ACLs okay so I'm doing this enabling the seals yeah I have enabled I acknowledge and say save changes done so now uh, go to objects select the object and what you do under actions you can make public using the sales yeah make public right it is successful it is successful now you say yeah close now let me try this yeah I am able to uh, see the website or index.html successfully I am able to access this one. So just copy this one. Okay. So what next? So access the object using the browser. Yes, it is now. Okay. It's now. Now list the contents of the S3 bucket using CLI. The last one which I wanted to show you. Since the CLI is already configured, so you can again say ls now it is showing the bucket AWS S3. Okay. Uh, you can ask the bucket name. LS is ARNKETHA is my bucket name. S3 column LS S3 column slash slash should display the value. Yeah. So this one also take a screenshot and then place it into the folder. 
capture the screenshot. So yeah, finally we have uh, successfully completed this lab. So once you have done this, you, you can end lab. Say yes, this completes our lab. Thank you and bye.